The weight inside the boat is now 340 kilos, 750 pounds. Come on! And the Englishman looked well within himself in that lift, but then he looks like that in most events. All the competitors are allowed six lifts, and this is Dusko's third. It's the same weight, 340 kilos. It's looking tough for him. He must lock out those knees. Well, he made it, but that looked like the limit for him. He's certainly feeling it. Fourth lift, and he's attempting 360 kilos, 795 pounds. He's there. A great achievement by the Dutchman, but his hamstrings must be on fire. And our Brewer, having survived his earlier ducking at the same weight, and also with his fourth lift, and remember, he's been the French powerlifting champion four times. And you're on time. A very controlled lift, and he's certainly taking no chances with the referee. And that's a good lift by the Frenchman. And now Kings with his fourth lift. The weight is 380 kilos, 59 and a half stone. You know, that summarizes the man well. He's produced the extra nobody but he thought was there. Stone, three times his own body weight. And doesn't that seem very easy? And yet again, he seems to have infringed the rules. David Webster tells him to keep his back straight. And of course, having to lift 400 kilos again means expending a lot more precious energy. He's there, and it looks like he could even lift the QE2. He's 66 stone. It's not going, and he readjusts his stance as John Paul anxiously watches. Oh, I think you heard that saying no, and that's it. Wisely, he's not. He's got two more in reserve if he so requires carefully strapping his wrists. I wonder if he's in trouble. No, he just delayed it. He loves a victory, doesn't he? What's the use of keeping feeling secret? Anyway, that's his third win with a remarkable performance by Jeff beating the powerlifters Brulwa 